across too, didn't I? Yeah, you did. Uh, an everlasting point. Uh, we'll have a re we don't know how this exactly the extent of all of his injuries after, Who cares? after he was examined, and uh, we'll talk more about it. My this. father's a gynecologist. Let him examine him, if you know what I mean. Yeah, you're hilarious. I don't mean to be hilarious. Side headlock by Tim Horner. And the intensity in these four athletes' faces really tells a story because it's all on the line right here on national television. Where else but the UWF? And it is sudden here. Horner. Great athletic maneuver, scoop slam. Lane back to his feet and a great arm drag into the arm bar. Yeah, but see, he's going to the arm after he was already working on the head. I don't know if that's a smart move. Lane rakes the eyes and enables him to make the tag. Oh, beautiful arm drag. I think he got his hair, though. Bobby's got that long hair, and it's a good handle. I think Horner wouldn't be above pulling it. Looked to me like a great athletic move, good arm drag. Really got in deep underneath him. I think he could have done that to me or Eddie Gilbert. I think it's certainly possible. There's Jim Cornett, who's certainly displeased with what has transpired thus far. I'm sure his mother would be very proud of the UWF World Tag Team titles. Well, and, you're not kidding. Anybody not, would be proud of that. And obviously, that's your, your all's goal, quite obviously. Yes. Well, I guess uh, you think you can uh, trust uh, Eddie Gilbert. If Eddie Gilbert thinks he can trust you, maybe it's a marriage made in heaven or somewhere. It sure is. He's the only guy that was looking. When he said he was going to be there, he was. Boy, these guys are going wide open. They haven't slowed down for a second. That's what I like about guys that aren't that big because they go, 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 go. Look at this action. You can't even call it. And these aren't little men either. They're they're in the 200 to 35 pound range. They're in such magnificent condition. They're lean fighting machines. Very little body fat on any of the four wrestlers in the ring. See, that's I think Eddie Gilbert and my forte. Our th we are a very smooth tag team. We're very fast. We're very strong. But I think that the Lightning Express doesn't have that killer instinct. And I didn't used to have it. But boy, now that I do, that's a beautiful arm drag. Stanley, I think, rushed in a little bit, seized the moment because he thought Horner couldn't see him. He rushed in a little bit, got a little careless. Both these teams like to, to operate with it wide open, that wide open tempo. And I think that the team that can dictate the tempo the longest in this match will certainly have the advantage Remember, one fall or television time remaining. We've allowed plenty of time for this simply phenomenal tag team matchup. We thank you very much for being with us on this great television station. There you go. Nice leg trip rolled up into a very nice headlock. A great series of offensive maneuvers by Stan Lane, but Brad Armstrong reversed it very quickly into the hammerlock. Boy, when you're down flat on your face on a hammerlock, it's almost impossible to get up. Great tag. Double team in here. That's not legal. He's got four seconds, four, five. That was five seconds to the top. Maybe you should get you an official shirt and start officiating. Well, if I could do a better job than Edward Falk, maybe I will. It may take your job if you get too smart. Well, it's uh, certainly available, I would, I would assume. I see why with the way you're doing but it. But you might want to concentrate on the tag team champions. Don't That's going to occupy all your thoughts. Don't, Don't worry, worry about my job. Side headlock, Tim Horner, who is in great condition, I'll tell you. All four of these guys, as a matter of fact, and I think Cornette should be commended. His team, U.S. Tag Team Champions. Horner beat Bobby Eaton to the punch. Shot. He's been in the rules there a little bit, fighting fire with fire. Cornette's up on the apron. I He's certainly not him. happy with the way things are going. But Horner, little double teaming of them for themselves, the Midnight Express. They're a great team. They know every trick in the book. Well, the Lightning Express did it first with that chop in the corner with the double arm twist. I don't blame him. I get a little upset, too. Both teams will utilize that the referee's four count. Oh, what a team move. What an awesome elbow by Bobby Eaton. And I don't think anybody in wrestling can deliver those high-impact maneuvers any better than Eaton. Who cr great behind the leg. The lateral press got him a two count. And Incredible. remember, the, the Midnight Express titles are not on the line, but the World Tag Team titles Currently held by the Lightning Express. They are on the line here. And, of course, the Rock and Roll Express, Ricky Morton and Robert Gibson, speaking of the Express teams, will be returning to the UWF for some great action uh, in upcoming weeks. Well, Tim Horner's in a bad way now. They know what to do. But when they get you, they're like a shark. Circle a couple times and zing. And when one guy's got the referee, see, now Brad Armstrong comes in. He's concerned about his partner. But he needs to get out of there because it's leaving the referee over there and it leaves Bobby Eaton plenty of time to do what he can. And Eaton's taking advantage of the moment, the referee out of position, and Eaton Beautiful. really delivered a couple of clubbing blows to Tim Horner, and that's gonna take the momentum away, most assuredly from the Lightning Express.